Chargers, it's Mrs. Butler, and I am missing you guys so much. So I thought it would be fun if we could do some art together. I am sitting in my front yard at an art table because this project is a little bit messy. But you know what I always say, if it isn't messy, it isn't fun. So today, this activity is Art with Saran Wrap. And let me show you what you're going to need. You're going to need some paper. I like to do mine on white because then all the bright colors show up really well. You're going to need a roll of Saran Wrap. You're definitely going to need some paper towels or some wipes. I suggest a trash can with a bag inside so that all the stuff that has paint on it can just go straight in there and then you can throw it away. You're probably going to need possibly a pair of scissors and whatever colors of paint you want. Now, since I'm missing my friends at Heritage Hall so much, I thought my painting today, I thought I could make it with Heritage Hall colors. So let me grab these. They're right over here on this table. I have blue, and this one is washable. I have gold, which is acrylic. Remember, if you use acrylic paint and you get it on your clothes or something, it won't come out, so be really careful if you use acrylic. And then I have some white acrylic. The first thing I'm gonna do, I'm gonna tip you guys down so you can see my paper. I am going to start with blue and just put dots all over my paper. Spread it all out. Next, I'm gonna do some gold. My gold is kind of a little bit shiny. This is just paint that I, for the most part, had around my house. The next thing you're gonna do, I'm gonna save my white for later. But you can use whatever colors you want, whatever colors you have at your house. It's fun to try mixing all sorts of colors together to see what you get. Okay, now you're going to take your saran wrap. You're going to lay it out. And I have to cut mine because I lost my package. All right. Now, friends, you can take your hands and spread it around. What I like to do is use a rolling pin. Now your rolling pin might get a little bit dirty, but if you're using washable paint, it should wash right off. Okay, so spread it around however you want to. Mine's kind of making a print because the table that I'm on has a print underneath it. Now, after you have rolled it or spread it with your hands and you have it the way you like it, Pull the saran wrap off. And this is why I suggest, suggest having a trash can because then it can just go straight in the trash. Now, with my Heritage Hall colors, I think that I want to add a little bit of white. So I put some white on there and I'm going to repeat the process again. I might have to pause. Oh, I got it. Here is the saran wrap. It's being a little bit stubborn. So I'm going to pause for just a second so I can get my saran wrap. All right, friends, I got the saran wrap over my white. And now I'm going to repeat the same process either with your hands or with a rolling pin until it's just the way you want it to look. And then you're going to pull the saran wrap off again and put it straight in the trash. So here is my painting with Heritage Hall colors. I kind of like the way the texture of my table came through on the paper. I also have a little bit of glitter at home, so I'm going to sprinkle a little bit of gold glitter and some iridescent glitter onto my picture so it's really sparkly. 
I would like to show you some other pictures that I made and see if you can guess what colors I used. All right, so here is one. Can you guess what colors I used on this one? Oh, if you said red, you're right. If you said yellow, you're right. And if you said pink, you're right. But if you said orange, nope, I did not use orange. These colors mixed together to make orange. Let me show you another one. All right, what colors do you think I used on this one? If you said pink, I used pink. It's kind of a metallic pink. And I used dark blue, and I used light or turquoise blue. If you think I used purple, nope, I did not use purple. These colors mixed together made the purple. Isn't that pretty? All right, I have one more to show you for colors. All right. Here we go. What colors do you think? If you said green, yep, I used green. And I used yellow. And I used turquoise on this one. Now, I want to show you one more. Here's another Heritage Hall painting that I made. I made this one when I was inside, so it does not have the texture of my table. But look. They both look so different. You see, they look so different. I hope that you have had a great time making some Saran Wrap art. This is something you can do over and over and over again, mixing colors. I hope you guys are having a great summer. And I'm going to be posting a lot more art videos, so be looking for them, okay? I'd love for you to email me what your pictures look like. S. Butler at heritagehall.com. Bye, guys.